Hi, here is Boda, and today we are going from Koblenz to Mainz in the BR401, that the one that comes with the base TSW root, uh, TSW3 root. Everyone that owns this new German route will own this local, so everyone can do this service. For now, it's one of the only layers that we have. Here, it's a 12 car uh, consist, and let's get started. So, we'll do it just like yesterday. So, we need first, thank first. Let's just take out, let's put here the reverser. Yeah. Let's take out everything from here. Yeah. Open the doors. Uh, master switch on. Cab lighting. Doors are open. Let's turn on the SIFA. And it's here in the back. And LZB and PZB both on. I will leave AFB off. I will drive without AFB today. We are using without AFB. So you can feel better the route. Let's go outside camera. Here we are. Nice. Let's just take a picture now. Uh, like here and just like this for the thumbnail. <laughs> Wait a little bit. Let me see if we have everything here that we need. Turn on the key here. Lock. We can take already the brakes and let's close the door. Sound the horn <laughs> in the middle of the night <laughs> and close the doors. They just close now. Let's turn a little bit the brightness here down. Yeah like this too bright yeah and yeah and yeah and I think we can start going let's see if everything is fine yeah let's put the bright lights Here we go. Not this one. I want to press the release button. I think we need to maintain 40 kilometers per hour maximum now. Maybe less. No, it's 40. Right. Red signal here? No. Train. the speed will get up to 140 let's take this the, the FPS yesterday on the stream the FPS was a lot lower than this maybe it's because of the, the stream itself let's see how it goes today I will leave it there so you can see the performance we are in the higher settings I'm using some mods not a lot of them, but some. I think we 
can start accelerating now. This is a much better acceleration curve than the VR-103. This is only one of the two services. I, I put it on July 21st, the longest day of the year. So hopefully we will catch some uh, a morning sun, sun rising up, but I'm not sure about that. Let's see what happens. Speed. Yeah, the frame rate is much better today. Maybe it was because of the stream yesterday. When you stream, the you get much lower FPS. It's better to pre-record to have higher quality. And I saw the stream from yesterday, and I, and I saw the when I move the camera, it gets very. Uh, Compressed, you know? Does it look good? So I I was thinking about doing a stream today, but it, it, it is better to pre-record. I need to I need to get up with it and try to improve uh, the streams, the stream quality. I need to look into it and maybe try to fix it some some way. the speed for now and we have a log 60 it's the same graphic settings than yesterday I'm running the night you take up the, the FPS and just cruise along opportunity for us to see the the light uh, at night let's go to the outside camera take a shot uh, for here from here Nice and Oop. here we go. Oh, now with the curve, ah, I can catch almost all the train. Need to be careful with the speed changes. We know that they have a little bit of that here on the route. it coming not for now just give it a little bit of power just maintain the speed Saw it on the graph that we have a slowdown in front of us. Let's see if, uh, cannot see much, but you can have a look. So how the route looks at night. It's much nicer in the day. <laughs> can see stuff. It's fair to show every part of it, even the night run.
to easily maintain speed just use the how do I say just use AFB some speed restriction about here but I cannot see it it is in one kilometer so let's see if it shows something to us because yesterday I, I remember that sometimes it doesn't show us the speed reduction like it's not showing us this one it's less than a kilometer now and I didn't see the reduction so Put it ourselves. I think it's 100. 110. Yeah. See? There was not. Wo I think it's missing a sign over there. <laughs> it happened yesterday. It was not. It was not me that missed the sign. It simply doesn't have one. I think that's uh, that's that's a bug, for sure. If I know German routes, they they they, they have the the yellow triangle before the speed reduction, and this one doesn't have one. I, I didn't saw that. Not yesterday, not today. I was getting more attention. That's why I bring up the graph. You say, ah, oh, you can use the the HUD, or you can use something to to watch for it, but. Uh, to drive it like this, it's more immersive. You can see the the moonlight of the of the river. You can watch the, the cars go by. That's nice. Now the speed goes to 100. Now we see it goes to down to 100. Just like yesterday. You can leave it slow down little by little. 1.6, 1.5 I'm not putting any any brake I just have the throttle off and the speed slowly comes down I'll give it a little bit to break just enough for the 110 here the 110 no, for the 100 here and just cross it just when we needed it the brakes this lo this loco is much easier to drive and I'm driving without AFB it's much easier to drive the ICE than the 130 the brakes it has nice brakes the 130 but the acceleration it's not good it comes in that's why we Get to a lower speed here, close to the station. I'm liking the light. Seems nice around here. Now it goes to 120. Need to wait for the back of the train. Get through the speed limit there. And it went around speed limit, so. That we can accelerate now to 120. Let's put it to full power. Any 
quickly brings the speed up. Now my dog just shaked here. I think the microphone picked it up. I'm really liking this route. I, I think... Is it worth buying? I, I didn't play enough of it, but... First impressions, yes. It's one of a kind, like it's the first old route that we have in TSW, electric one, will come another one uh, just next week, will come out, they just announced it today that will come out next week, the Nindertal band, so we'll have another layer on this route, so that's nice, I, I, I think it's, it's, it's getting it's definitely better than the the last uh, US route that came out, uh, New York to Trenton. It seems to me that is it's a, it's a better buy than that one. Not because that one is bad, but like for example, here they put the AI services. They they use more layers. On the other one, we have lots of things to drive on it. But like for example, why does the new New York Penn Station doesn't have the AI uh, M7 and M3 used on on Long Island Railroad, you know. I don't know why they don't they don't have this type of stuff, or why they don't have like the uh, some CSX uh, uh, freight uh, stuff in some of the 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 sidings, you know. Seems a little bit rushed. This is this one seems a little bit more polished. Uh, they they tend to polish more the German roots and the English ones than the, than the American ones. The best American route by far it's the Peninsula Corridor one. That's the best one. Now the speed comes down to 100 again. Need to slow down. Slow down, slow down, slow down. 100. Let's give it a little bit more power. but I think the speed limit was 130. I didn't saw the 130. That happened to me yesterday. I, I think they are missing some signs on the route. It's probably it. I don't know. Now go to, up to 110. Can give it just a little bit of power. Next time I will do another one with the uh, 103, but from the other side and in the summer and or maybe I can do it in the winter, the middle of the winter with light, the middle of the day in winter, yeah, probably with or that or, or in the summer during the day, so you can see the route with all this greenery. But I think in the winter would be nice too. We can already go to up to 110. Don't let me forget that. The acceleration on this one is good. Be careful. Not let the speed get higher than 110.
Here the speed should go higher. If it is just a straight line. See it? No. Okay. Here's a freight train on the side. Big downside that I'm remembering now about this route is why they didn't put the 155 in this route. There is no explanation why they don't use a 155 on this route. It is used, it is used this time of the this time this period of time. It is used. Uh, it fits right on the on the thing. Why they didn't use it? Oh, need some alteration to the cabin. We don't care about it. Just put it. At least it's a minimum. Yeah, you should do the alteration that is needed to the loco, but why not? It's something that I cannot explain why they do this type of stuff. Down, down to 90. the wrong button. It was not Sifu that I wanted, uh, PZB that I wanted to press. I wanted to press the Sifu one. There you go, down to 90. Uh, <laughs> right by the church here. The houses are very close here. Look how nice it is. It is nice around here. See? Nice section of the game. Oh, this this route is so scenic. Uh, like, I love, I'm loving it, driving it. And, and there is a good thing about it. It's that it misses. We don't have like a branch line here, but the route like it curves along the curves along the river. That's nice. That's really nice. I'm certain that they will, in the future, write write this. You can appoint this. They will do like some 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 DLC that you can use to play this route on on uh, today. Nah? You can use it to play uh, uh, today. They will do some type of DLC with uh, use locos from other other routes. Oh, so you can play on this one. I'm certain of it. <laughs> but hopefully they will update the station and things like that. I don't know if they, they will do that. Maybe they, they will just use the same route. Like they did like, for example, in Great, in Great Western Express. Something like that, you know? Just confirming that the speed limit is what it is supposed to. And it is, I'm still learning the route, so I need to do this. When I do more runs with the route, I will start knowing the, the pattern. And then I can drive even without uh, ever going to the pause menu to watch the graph. And yesterday, was not a bad run of, after all of it because uh, I went to see the score we, we only had like less than 20 points uh, to get the gold medal yeah it was a nice run for the first run gets easier when you are used to it 
everyone plays as he likes. I'm not saying that you need to play this way. Everyone plays uh, uh, the way that is better for, for, for each and every one of us. So I like to play it this way. As I say, I think it's more immersive. But that's what I feel. It's not equal for everyone. I think we can already speed up. It was 100. <laughs> I'm, I keep talking and I just forget the... the restrictions. We are in the slope. Cut down a little bit the speed. Now I can leave it. now let's get a bit past the station This route is definitely better than the last one. For sure. That uh, Oldenburg uh, Bremen. This one is better. If you are indecisive of buying this one or the other one, just buy this one. <laughs> you still get the 110. So this this is definitely the bet better of the two. For sure. Without any doubt. Like, you don't need to get it for the 155. Uh, Rus you, most of people already have Rus ignored, so you can buy the 155 for that route and use it in almost every other German route. And for the 452, uh, uh, 425, uh, <laughs> it's. Uh, <laughs> You just don't use it enough on that route, so just get it for the, for the, if you want it, just get it for the Hopstrack Rhine route and use it on, 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 on other German routes that you can use it. It's much more better than that and you can get it for a cheaper price. The only good point of getting the, the other one is you get the 110 to use on layers on other routes. I don't think you can use this 110 as a layer. Because this is from a different time, you know, time period. But I'm not sure about that. I buy every German route because I love German routes. That, that's why. <laughs> I don't have all of them for PC, but when they have the right price, I buy them and just like yesterday the car goes by the just crosses the train line on 
just the right on this, just the same uh, crossway. So I think it's a bug. No, I'm certain that it is a bug. Second time on the same place. Mm -hmm. Too much coincidence. Here comes another train. That's busy the route. At least this is the second service that I do and it seems busy. It will get more busy with the VR uh, 6 to 3, isn't it? 6 to 4? I don't remember the name. 6 to something, I think it's 6 to 3. Point 2. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. One twenty, but we, we were already at one twenty, weren't we? No. I see the speed goes to one one thirty. I don't see it going to one thirty. I think there are missing some signs here on the road. Maybe it's me that uh, it's distracted. Just tell me on the comments if you saw saw the sign, and I I don't know. I I, I will try to watch the the. the this recording to see if I found it. 120, 120 here. Maybe it was in the station. Sometimes it happens. You have a speed limit on the station. Then you are focused watching other stuff and you don't see it. But going in a lower speed is not a big problem. Going higher, it is. AFB, it's much easier to maintain the the speeds and the time here on the route. You can just put AFB and just use it to maintain the speed here. Now I saw it. I saw it there. Here the lighting seems nice. Just leave it a little bit. I can accelerate a little bit. This time I saw it. Maybe it's me that, I, that, I, that, I, that it's missing the signs. I don't know. Seven, bit more power. Twenty-eight, twenty-nine. Just maintain the speed. Thirty. Shut up, Sifa.
try to maintain the speed. 120 again. brakes Get just a little bit of power Sixty, wasn't it? Yeah, seems like it. I think this is the part of the route that we come out from the river. Almost getting there. So basically, with the BR one zero uh, four one zero uh, four zero one, <laughs> with the BR four zero one, you only can do night runs because uh, the other one it is at nine nine. I think it was nine nine something or eight something. I think it is dark time too. Even in summer, even in the longest day of the year like is the 21 of June I think is it the 21 of June that I put or 21 of July now I don't remember but if you can get in the day in, on, uh, with the uh, day of the light it will, it's just by, by some days because uh, uh, I wanted to do this not I didn't want to do night run, I wanted to do daylight run, but no no use to it. And you can see that it is summer because it didn't start raining. <laughs> I, I put it with a little bit of clouds and the weather just went nice. This is definitely 160 territory. Let's get a little bit more power on it. Now, if I remember, need to be careful when we arrive at the station because, like yesterday, we didn't have any warning <laughs> about uh, a change of lane. So, 150 now. Fifty. 
Something went off. What happened? What happened? <laughs> Did I pass something? I really don't know. Okay. I think I pressed something that I shouldn't. Maybe do, 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 do I activated the... No, this is a PC... It is a PCB problem. What happened? I passed something. I was complying with the speed limit. I really don't know. Maybe some type of bug. I don't know. But at least it gets more exciting. Yeah, no, give me this brakes. Give it power. Why is the train not moving? Ah, started to move now. Everything fine? Why the brake went off? Didn't pass any signal. Once again, I say maybe just me, but I think there are some bugs with the signals in this route. Okay, around 10 minutes. Again here. What the? F that's why. Yeah, that's why. That's why. But was no sign of of the slowing down of the speed there. Ah, uh, no. Let's leave it like this. I don't care. Oh, that's why. That's why. I didn't saw that. Oh God. Um. Want to curse now? Was it me that didn't saw that coming? It's so strange, man. It's really strange. You do this little turnover. Yeah. Now it goes to up to 160 again. up to speed let's finish this 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 run oh god i don't like when that happened happens oh i will definitely see what happened on the video when i finish this run didn't saw a sign that we were going to change lanes. Yeah. Mm. 
I'm get I'm getting mad with that. No, it was my fault. I saw the sign telling 150. It didn't slow down. I'm thinking about the signs over there, what happened back there. I really don't know. Hopefully we don't get, get too late. careful coming close to the station because now I, I will be watching for this the speed drop let's see if, if it shows twelve kilometers and for now everything green Sixty, it's all the way. I think we'll get on time there. goes faster. No sign of speed redu reduction till now. Still have some distance to cover. That sign did he had a triangle but it didn't show no speed limit. I think it should show one, but it didn't show nothing there. Maybe this one shows? No, see? Everything green. No sign of a speed restriction over there. And we know without because of the graph that in one kilometer 
we will have a speed restriction. Let's, let's see how uh, it is to 100 and then comes down to 80. Uh, 80, 70 and uh, around 80, yeah. Ten here it shows the ten speed restriction. Okay. Okay. It showed it here one kilometer earlier, but then we know that it comes even down to not the speed that they're saying here. They're saying uh, about eighty. I think it goes lower than that. Sign everything fine from now. 100 speed limit here. This sign is fine too. like this coming to the station now there's the yellow sign there that means that we need to slow down maybe it was me that didn't saw it yesterday and even today <laughs> some of the cases but here and you need to acknowledge this. But the other day, the I had the PCB on, you know, and it, it didn't come off. So, how, how do I explain that? We did just turn because the safety system it helps you with that. Makes it makes it safer. Now, when you see that sign, you are expecting a turn or a speed reduction of some kind. No, and we are getting just in time. Oh, or or no, <laughs> I think this case is because of the red sign over there. And yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's why we have safety systems so we can use them in case of an emergency like this one. That double yellow sign means uh, a red sign next to it, but I, I thought it was on the station already, but no, it's not on the platform. We're waiting for some train. Let me see. I, I think it's that one that is leaving now the station. See? When that one goes away. This sign will come up. Let's have the brakes released by, by then. Brakes are released. They are charged. It's off. Uh, yeah, you can go. Come on. You cannot go above of twenty five. Let's acknowledge when you pass the signal. Acknowledge it. I'm using the mouse now instead of the keyboard. Now I can go up to 45. Let's see the speed limit. Speed limit is fine. Go up to 45. 
Forget to press the Sifa. Here there is a pedal of Sifa too. it here double yellow sign again double yellow light just to tell us that is a red one just next to it now the 500 Hertz will turn on sure it starts slowing down yeah the 500 <laughs> this means that we need to get lower than 25 within some meters yeah now we stop right in the sign there if it is like yesterday they meant us to stop just at the right place yeah door no one getting in or out is there some someone in the train sometimes this happens it's all empty look sometimes we have lots of passengers going in, in and out and sometimes we don't have no one <laughs> Can lock the doors. Done. Yeah, this time we get the gold medal. This part was not the good one here, and here I, I was, uh, I was <laughs> still thinking about this one. So the rest, well, pretty much. Uh, a good close follow-up of from the speed limits uh so that's it for this video see you and uh some next time